Hey guys, and welcome to another Chaotic Perfection tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you my Sony Vegas settings. This is my YouTube account, and if you could please subscribe, that would be much appreciated. Okay, so to start things off, now that you're in Sony Vegas, I use 7.0. You're going to go to File, and go to your Properties. And now for under Video, we're going to go to Template, and you're going to title it exactly how I have it here shown in the video. And the width is 480, height is 360. Then you're going to choose non for frame rate, sorry, is going to be 20. Then you're going to choose one square and non progressive scan. Now for full resolution rendering quality, I choose good, motion blur type, and then the interlace method, blend fields. And you can, if you want, check this box off to start all new projects with these settings. Now going under audio, uh, master bus mode is stereo, sample rate 44,100. Now we're going to ruler, and you can just copy the settings down exactly how I have them here in the video. Summary and audio CD, I just like to keep these normal, you don't really have to change those. And now if you go to file and you open a video clip, whatever you'd like to render, you just open that up into the time frame and edit your video however you would like. I'm just going to show you a little clip I'm going to use. You just highlight it, or if you can, that's what I like to do. Then you're going to go to file, render as, and here are the settings that I render it when I'm rendering. Template, uh, you're going to make it a custom template. You can title it anything you would like. I title mine HQ for high quality. Then the render video rendering quality, uh, I choose best. Then we're going to go to audio and you can copy everything shown here in the video the video format is uncompressed there's a lot of different ones you can choose I just prefer uncompressed And then once you have the settings that you feel comfortable with, you're going to go to template and title it and then save it, whatever you'd like to title. And I'm not going to render it because I already have. I'm just going to show you guys how I, how I would do it. And now I'm going to take you guys over to the converter I use for my videos. Okay, now this is my Magic Video Converter. This is what I use after I finished rendering my videos in Sony Vegas. You just browse and open the video that is finished rendering in Sony Vegas. And you can actually choose where you would like it to go after it is finished rendering. And these are the different formats you can choose when converting the video. I like to choose FLV. I just prefer that more. It makes your file size a lot smaller and then you just convert it and it should take about five minutes well thank you guys this has been another chaotic perfection tutorial